Hello and welcome to Goma Tom. Welcome to our playground. Today, we are preparing crispy pata. And of course, our main ingredient will be our pata ng baboy. And to season our boiling water, kailangan natin ng uh, onions, garlic, chili, pepper, salt, and of course, lemongrass. Sa Bisaya, tangad. Sa Tagalog, tanglad. So, kuha muna tayo ng, ano natin, kuha ng uh, lemongrass natin. Ah, come with me. Pag niluluto tayo sa goma tom, we just go to our garden, pick lang tayo ng, natin, ng ingredients natin. So ito, pila lang tayo dito. Yan, so. Ito yung tanglad natin. No? Yan. And then ito, since it's grass, all you do is put it back. Yan. Put a little soil on top. And then, mamaya, didiligan yan. Buhay na naman yan. So this one, I'll just go and wash this and then we'll start cooking. So here's my lemongrass, cleaned and washed. So I'll tie this. Yan, gagawin mo lang siya. Ibabundle lang natin yan. Yan yan. Tapos ibabundle mo lang siya. Yan. Yan na yan. Tapos lalagyan dito. But before doing that, kailangan pitpitin natin yung roots ng lemongrass natin para lumabas yung flavor niya. Okay, just like that. Just to, to bring the flavor out. Should be good. Mmm! So let's heat our water. Lalagyan natin dito. And then, tatabi ko muna itong uh, pata na to. I'll put some chili. Magtira tayo ng konti para sa sauce natin mamaya. Mm. And then, we'll put in some garlic. Right here. Ayan. Tapos, lagyan natin ng luya. Ayan. Let's cut it. Para lumabas yung flavor natin ng uh, ginger natin. Okay. Put this here. The seasonal water. Lagyan natin ng whole black pepper. Put in lots. Okay. I put in salt. And soy sauce. So now our water is seasoned already. Siguro I put in about a cup of uh, soy sauce. Lalagyan natin yung pata natin. You know, normally, ito pata ito, pag, pag naluto ito, nag-bend siya na gano'n. So what you want to do is just cut to its connective tissues, yung tendons niya dito. Yan lang, maliit lang, para hindi siya masira yung, ano, yung skin niya. So now, I'll just put this here, and then we'll let it boil. There we go. We'll let this boil for about an hour, an hour and a half, depende kung gano'ng kalambot yung pata natin. So we'll leave this here. Habang hinihintay natin na kumulo ito, gawa na tayo ng sauce natin. No? Ang dipping sauce for crispy pata, usually, of course, andyan yung basic natin na, na suka, and then yung soy sauce, and then we'll put a little sugar. Not too much, just, just to taste. Yung nilagyan natin ng ingredients ito, basically, yun yung ilalagyan natin sa dipping sauce natin. So, we'll peel our garlic. Once makrush mo yung garlic, madali yung matanggal yung skin. Eh. And then, pinuhin lang natin ito. If you want the garlic, pinong pino. Marami. Garlic. And then, lagyan natin ng sili. Sarap. Manghang. Hmm? Alam nyo ba kung sa nagsimula yung ano, crispy pata dito sa Pilipinas? Ito actually, they um, give the honor to uh, Rod Ompauco no, of Barrio Fiesta. So, siya yung nag-invento dito sa Pilipinas ng crispy pata. Si Rod's a nice person. He's a nice guy. I know him personally. I've uh, eaten in all his restaurants. Masarap talaga yung paggawa niya sa crispy pata. Lagyan natin ng uh, onions. Some people, they like uh, using uh, red onion, so it doesn't really matter, no? Kung available sa'yo, white onion, yellow onions, or red onions, okay lang. And then, lagyan na sa sauce natin dito. Ooh, look at that, sarap niya. Lagyan natin ng ginger. So now, titikbo natin yung ginawa nating sauce. Dapat to, hindi niya in-overpower yung isa't isang ingredients. Dapat balance lang yung taste niya. Let's try this. Sarap! Yung crispy pata na lang. Okay na eh. Sige, balikan natin ito mamaya. Kunin na natin yung, yung pata natin na pinakaluan natin ng more than one hour. And then... Okay. Sige mo kung malambot yung meat niya. Okay, malambot naman siya. There you go. What we'll do, we'll prick this. And then we'll let it dry. By pricking it, magiging para siyang chicharon. And then, kung meron pa kayong oras, mas maganda to. Medyo ipauga ninyo. Pauga is patuyuin nyo na matagal. Mas tuyo siya for about, let's say, 3 uh, hours, 5 hours, let it dry. So we'll let this cool. So now, uh, i-deep fry natin yung pata natin using Doña Elena Pumas Olive Oil. Alright. Alright. 
So we are at uh, 140 to 150. So medium heat, sakto to. Lutuin natin tong pata natin. For that, lagyan natin siya ng asin. Yun. And then, ilalagyan na natin ang ating pata. Ooh. There you go. Takpa natin siya. And, it should cook in about mga 10 minutes lang. Okay? Check it out. So, after 10 minutes, the first fry niya, kukunin natin siya. And then, we we'll let it cool down for about 30 minutes and then, i-refry -re -re natin siya. And then, this time, mas mainit na yung oil niya. Okay? So, for now, we let it rest. And then, balik tayo. So, now, we increase the heat sa oil natin. So, now, I'm putting it in. This will cook for about another 10-15 minutes, no? And then, balik natin maya, maya. After 15 minutes, yan na. We'll take it out again. Oh. Lapit na. We let this cool for another mga 30 minutes. So, mamaya, we'll put this in a uh, high heat. And then, last uh, fry niya. And then, we're done. Okay? Now, we'll do our final fry. Mainit na talaga tong uh, mantika na to. And this one, will cook in... Woohoo! Last 15 minutes. Yan. Takpa na natin siya. We'll time it. On the 10th minute, ikot natin siya. And then, we're done. Crispy pata na yun. Pag hinihintay natin siya na maluto, gagawa lang ko ng decoration para sa plating natin. Yung decoration sa plate natin. Yun. Simple. Yan, pag nagluluto ka, it's just like playing, no? Na-enjoy mo lang every moment of it. And then, food tastes even better if you cook it with love. That's how you serve food, that's how you cook food. Lalo na if you eat it with your loved ones, mas masarap lalo na. Yan, there, open it. Parang nakaredy na yung plate natin. Pagluto ng crispy pata, dito na sila lagay. Maganda tignan. Let's check. Lakas, eh. Mm -hmm. Five more minutes, and then ikot na natin siya. Wow. Okay. Look at that. Ganda na, oh. Mm -hmm. Yan na yung final turn natin. Ten minutes. We're done. Let's see. Oh, beautiful. So, we drain lang natin to para ma drain lang yung oil. So, na drain na natin siya. We plate it. Crispy pata. Di pa tayo ng location si. Mulan. But let's try it here. See ya. Woohoo! Talagang crispy. Oh. Masawa natin. Mmm! One more. Masabi, kinukuha mo talaga pati yung mga onions. Oh! We'll try the meat. Up. Mm. So this crispy pata, we deep fried it in our Doña Elena Pomas olive oil. Sarap! So there you go, crispy pata. Classic and original Filipino food. Thank you so much for joining me here in Gomatom. Like, subscribe, and uh, don't forget to uh, press on the notification bell para alam nyo kapag meron tayong um, bagong video na lalabas. And then leave me a comment kung ano yung gusto yung uh, tikman or subukan natin lutuin or yun, maybe we can just talk about something else. And then, Try this in your own kitchen. Talaga magugusin it. So easy to do it. Medyo mahaba lang gawin pero madali. Thank you for watching me right here at Gomatong. See you.